And I'm really like feeling my crush for real, for like on some real stuff. She might be the one. And Ooh. baby, I need you in my life, in my life. Please, babe, don't go switch his eyes, switch his eyes. I swear this is where you reside, you reside. Please, babe, don't go switch his eyes, switch his eyes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh. Welcome back to my channel. It's your boy Chris Gilly, worth the milli. About to go silly. Take a girl to the telly, man. Before we get into this video, I need you to like, comment, subscribe, turn on the post notification. Well, yeah, get that bell right there. A ring a ding a ding ding. As you can tell by the title, what's going on today, man? I got a mukbang for y'all today. And I got some fries, you feel me? I got some fries. I got some Cajun pasta. I already opened it. And then I got some uh, spinach dip and some chips. On the way to 200K, I need your help, you feel me? On the way to 200K. We're almost there. So like I said... Go ahead, tell the whole family tree, everybody in your family to go ahead and subscribe to Gilly channel because it's about to go crazy. New merch on the way, as you already know, um, February is the month. So as you can tell, go turn on your post notification. You already know how I'm coming. Merch is on the way sooner than you think. So I need you to be the first one to cop your merch, the hoodies on the way. Y'all been asking how I really feel about my crush, you feel me? So. I'm here to tell y'all how I really feel and eat because I haven't ate all day. I'm kind of a little irritated right now because this is my second time doing this video. Um, I did it before and my head was cut off. I don't understand how that was possible, but my head was cut off. But you know, I love y'all, so I was like, listen, let me go ahead and make the video again and give y'all some content that y'all been wanting. Um, I was about to focus and eat. Because it's hard for me to multitask and talk and eat, da da da. You feel me? But listen, I might as well do it for y'all, cause I love y'all. You already know how to get it coming. Anyway, so um, a young nigga has a headache. Of course, I have to eat all day, but um, hmm. Let me tell y'all what I'm gonna do. Oh, uh, really? Y'all don't know where I'm at right now. I'm in my executive suite. You know I mean? I'm in my executive suite right now, relaxing. My little living room. I didn't show y'all the room. You feel me? I got a table back there. I got you feel me? All this couch. It's just like my relax room. Then I got another room I can walk into there. You feel me? Um, y'all haven't seen this side, but this is what happens when you level up. You feel me? It's all about leveling up in 2019. Level up, bro. You feel me? Like, I might make this my permanent house. This hotel might be my permanent house. I don't know if you really can do that. But, um, today, um, let's start off. Today was a good day. I mean, y'all didn't see my last video. Make sure you go see my last video. Um, a young nigga drove 12 hours. You feel me? I drove a long way to go see my crush. You feel me? And y'all went on the journey with me to go see my crush. And most guys don't do that. And when you drive and take trips, like, you better, um, you feel me, you better be feeling the person. It has to be. Like, there's no way you drive that far and you're not feeling the person. Guys don't do that. People don't do that. You're not normal if you do, you feel me? Like, why well, say, like, you know, it's about me. I had to really like you if I'm doing stuff like this. I had to really like you and be feeling you. Um, because that's wasting my time and my time is valuable. And as y'all can tell, you feel me? Like, I do videos for y'all and I don't have time to be wasted like that. Like, my time is very, very valuable, as you can tell. Cause I gotta make content for y'all. I have to make content for y'all. Uh, but, um, I'm really feeling this girl. Like, it's just like, when I'm like, when we talking, we have this connection that like, I never had with a female before. And I haven't been this happy in a minute. As y'all can tell and as y'all know, like Gilly's been single. For a minute, I was dating Maria for a long time. Then we taking a little break. 
no hard feelings, but we taking a little break. But now young niggas have a crush. Um, it's hard for me. You feel me? It's different for me because y'all know how I am and y'all know that young niggas not even interested. Like, y'all be like judging me off of my looks, the way I act, stuff like that. Like, where I dress like, yo, Chris, you got the whole, you, know, you feel me? You got females with all the, all the you got all the whole, all the, no, listen. It's not even like that, because y'all know how I am, you feel me? I don't entertain a lot of people, and I don't do it if I'm not really feeling you. So, now that I got a crush, it's just like, I had a wall built, because y'all been asking me, like, Chris, why you been single? Why you been doing this, da, da, da? It's just like, my last little thing I had with a girl, it was just like, it really hurt me to the point where I was not like, it was, it didn't, all right, I wasn't like really heartbroken, but it was just like a, yo, hey, yo, Chris, you need to focus on yourself and make sure you Gucci now. So that's why I took time to focus on myself and make sure my family was straight, me, my friends, my close family, make sure all of us were straight. So that's when I really just, Move to Houston, da, da da Make sure everything was straight with me and my family. You feel me? Make sure everything was straight. Focus on myself. And now it's just like, I was focused on myself for a minute. Focusing on myself. Making sure that my family is straight. And then, boom, came across my crush. And drove all this way. Like, like y'all know me. Y'all know me. Like, Guys don't do this like I said, and listen, I gotta, listen, I gotta be feeling you if I drove this far, no cap, no cap, cause I don't even be doing stuff like that at all, for real, Gilly driving is, come on, and, like, it's just, not new to me because I did it before, but it's just, like I said, my last thing with a girl is just like, I really was feeling the girl. When I kid you not, I was feeling her. Like, I put my all into that girl. I really thought that girl was the one, but it just came to the, the, to the sense that she wasn't. Like, it didn't work out. Like, not, not bashing her or nothing, but it just didn't work out. Because I guess we was like, out of state of mind, like, she was young and. I was still doing my thing, like, going, networking, stuff like that. Y'all already know how I am. Um, and she was young. But, without that being said, like, I really was feeling this girl. Like, when I get you now, I was feeling her. Like, I was traveling every other weekend to go drive hella, hella miles. Like, over, like, 1,400 miles driving. Like, driving. Like, spending my last, like, I was a college student. Spending my last, like, I was spending my last to go see her and stuff like that, to visit. Didn't even know who she was. I tried to do a long distance. And when I tell you everybody was down me, I was 10 toes. I was like, they was like, yo, Chris, it's not going to work. It's long distance. It never works. That, I'm telling you, grown ups are telling me all my friends are, Chris, it's not going to work. Me, I was like, bro, you crazy. Like, anything you put your mind to, it can, like, if you want it to work, it's going to work. You just need, you need trust and communication. I kid you not, that's like, that's all you really need in a relationship. So me, I was like, listen, it's gonna work. Like, I'm telling you, I'm feeling this girl. Like, this girl, like, I don't care where she live, you feel me? Boom, boom, but like, I'm feeling this girl. And regardless of what y'all talking about, it's gonna work. Boom, flew her out, Valentine's Day. Boy, it didn't spend a dime. Like, I was really feeling this girl. When I mean, feeling like my mom liked her, everything. Xavier liked her, like, everybody, my whole family liked her. And it just came to like, I don't know what happened, but ever after, since that, like after after uh, after spring break and stuff like that, everything just went shoom, straight down here. I don't know what, we was arguing every day. Like, it was just like, I don't know. And it just didn't work out for some reason. I was like, dang, like, I done let everybody, like everybody done told me so. And they were like, I told you so. It's like a word, I told you, I told you, Chris, that. But me, I was like, I really was, I'm telling you, riding for this girl. And it didn't work out. And I was looking stupid because they, they told me already, you feel me? So, they told me that. Boom, put on my what's name. Then boom, after that, boom, a wall just came. You feel me? A wall just came. Nobody can't get past that wall. Like, I kid you not, nobody can get past that wall. Like, at all. There's no way you can get past that wall. 
And it's just like, I guess that's why I was single, because I was like, boom, put the wall out, Chris, you feel me? Gilly, put the wall up and focus on yourself. And that's what I was doing. I was really focusing on myself. And I took these out. When I was focusing on myself, I started to be, I was able, I'm, I was able to grow and elevate. And when, after, like, what I mean by that, I really moved. I, I kid you not, I moved states, and I really grew and elevated. Like, it was just like, I didn't worry about nobody else. I was focusing on myself. You feel me? Not worrying about nobody. And then, boom. Now you got Gilly. You feel me? Y'all got Gilly. And all the people in the past, it's just like, I really, like, if I ever talk to you in my life, Ever told you? Everybody knows that I never did none of the per- people I did in my. I never did nothing wrong to none of them. If I talked to you, I was talking to you because I wanted you to be my girl. You remember? Know? Y'all had a chance to be my girl, and I really was feeling them. Like on uh, anybody, I'm telling you, like it goes to back to middle school, back to kindergarten when I was a little jit. I was talking to you. If I wanted you to be my girl or whatever, I really wanted you to be my girl. But it didn't work out. It never worked out. And I did not know why. I put everybody first and it's just like, now, Chris, put yourself first. And then now when I like started focusing on myself and make sure my whole team was eating and make sure everybody was like, you feel me? Anybody in my circle is going to eat anybody. And we, I'm like, I'm going to make sure I contribute to like the team. And that's what I did. Moved, boom, boom, boom. We was working. To, we took over, you feel me? We took over. Made sure my family was straight, you feel me? Made sure everything was straight. And then, boom, focused on myself. Dated Maria, you feel me? Me and Maria was good. Then she cheated on me. But then it was just like, boom. Hard times came. No, no disrespect, but like, hard times came. And then, now I got a crush. And now, like, this whole day today, like, I'm really like, Yo, she might be the one, and that's how I felt before, you feel me? I felt like that before, but maybe she might be the one. I don't know. It just takes time. And hopefully she is. I don't know. But only time can tell. I need y'all to stay tuned for that. I was asking her to be on camera, but she kind of shy. But today went very good today, and I wanted y'all to know that. I wanted her to be, like, you feel me? I wanted to do this move bang, because y'all been asking. Uh, yo, do the win up. How you feel about it now? Yeah, like, I'm really feeling this. You feel me? I don't know how she feels. She might get that in a different video. But, um, I'm going to try to capture that. But, that's all to it. Like, there's a connection. And the connection is all you really need in the night. You feel me? It's all you really need. If y'all can connect. It doesn't worry about what everybody else feel about, da, da, da. Like, make sure y'all good and then, you feel me? That's all to it. Um, make sure y'all take, your, uh, take these tips. All the fellas out there, listen. Don't worry about what nobody else say about, you feel me? Your crush, da, 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 da. Like, make sure y'all good at first. And then, boom, boom, boom. You feel me? Boom, boom, boom. You feel me? Because if you boom, boom, boom. And then you worry about how everybody else feel. Then it's not really how you feel. And if you feel good, then it's going to be good at the end of the day. And right now, it's good at the end of the day. Like, I'm really on some real stuff. My crush, like, hey, baby girl, I know you about to watch this. Listen, hey, a young nigga feeling you. And I'm really, like, feeling my crush for real, for, like, on some real stuff. She might be the one, and I want y'all to know that. A young nigga up to some. I'm really up to some. But listen, y'all stay tuned. Um, like I said, I can't like eat and like talk at the same time. I used to be a good multitasker, but listen, I can't do it anymore. It's just like, I don't know. I can't do two things at once. So I'm gonna finish my food because I got a big headache. Um, y'all stay tuned for the rest of the video. Merch is on the way, on the road to 200K. Like I said before, tell your whole family tree, everybody, your pets, everybody, get Gilly to 200K. We need to get Gilly to 200K. And because we're going up, we're going up. And I need y'all to know, like, listen, 
we're the strongest gang, and I, I, I know y'all might not think so for the people that's not in the Gilly gang. But I want y'all to know that, listen, I really rock with my Gilly gang, and the Gilly gang, to me, and will forever be the strongest gang, where I don't care what you talking about. Like, we will all smoke, don't care. But I want y'all to know the Gilly gang, strongest gang, on the way to 200K, I'm about to finish my food. And my strawberry lemonade and without that being said. Um, y'all spend me up. I'm about to be home soon. About to get the twins back. For y'all that don't know, hey twins, if y'all watching the video, I'm gonna get you back. So sleep with one eye open. I hope y'all ready. Because y'all really prank the prankster and I'm going to come harder. And give me some more ideas and leave the description below. And I'm gonna run it up and until then, yes sir! Hey,